Hello guys, and today we're going to have a look at the rule on Kentrosaurus with Croc. Probably my most favorite Dino Rider of all time, because I actually had this Dino Rider as a kid. I did, I got it for my, I would have been 10, about 10 years old, 10, 10, yeah, my 10th birthday. So, um, I don't have the original Kentrosaurus that I had as a kid that got broken a long time ago and it was well played with. So these are other models that I acquired in in the last few years. Anyway, let's first have a look at the amazing box art. So awesome box art as usual with the Dino Riders. So here we can see Croc is actually running a bit of a muck and kind of the Valorians are kind of engaging in a battle with him. So here we've got the, the club doing some damage, breaking some rocks. This guy is, you know, running for cover and yeah, Croc's just there all powered up. He's, it's funny because he's holding like a joystick kind of control there, which is not actually part of the toy. And then you've got the, the Plotticus, Deonicus, Kotsukoatlus. So there, there's a full on battle going on here. And yeah, and Croc's the star of the show. So we get a little bit of information here about the figure. I'll open it up. So we've got the window here. We've got Croc, Brain Box, the, the figure, the armor. So I'm not going to open this up. All that's in there is another plastic tray with... The rest of the armor, the comic book, and the weapons for for Croc. So I'll just, as you can see, what's included all there, and also the instructions. Here, mind you, they've got the series one weapons but in this particular box i've got the series two weapons which are on the instructions so a bit of a little interesting fact there you got the proof of purchase this was around $17 something, judging by the, the sticker. So, and Classic Series 2 bio artwork. So got the bio there. We've got the Kentrosaurus and yeah, the artwork, which is the awesome Series 2 battle scene with no Kentrosaurus that included. So let's have a look at Kentrosaurus himself. Kentrosaurus is a bit more rarer to find as it's Series 2 and quite a popular figure so at the front we've got the brain box the only thing articulation he has is the the legs the front and back front and back legs the rubber band degraded many years ago so which is a common problem I'm using just an elastic band. Tail is flexible. We've got the club. And a common problem with this club is 
the, this joint can be a bit loose. So one way to kind of fix that is you can just put a bit of blue tack. This one's still holding up. I've got a croc there. So pretty much the armor can go up and down. Again with this gun. So you can kind of have croc all shielded up or all opened up and adjust that. Another common problem is this joint can be damaged. Then we also have articulation there with, this, with the seat with the guns and obviously these can rotate as well. We'll get Croc out. He just kind of slots in there. Both sides are identical. And yeah, pretty well armored dinosaur, especially with the the spikes of the Kentrosaurus. Obviously, Kentrosaurus was not a big Stegosaurus. Stegos not a Stegosaurus. In the Stegosaurus family, it wasn't a it wasn't a large played a dinosaur obviously much bigger as the toy or in the cartoon and you got croc obviously different color so if we got croc in the artwork here so obviously different different color you got red and black there on his top so a little few little differences so he's it has, it's got the series 2 gun actually what I will do I will open it up move that just to, to show the di the difference with the weapons So pretty much, it's got like this cardboard on the bottom. And everything's included in there. So if we grab the instructions, and as you can see, these are series two weapons. Uh, nothing too flashy there. And as you can see, he's got the series two weapons there with Croc. And as it showed, in the photo, it's got series one weapons. So this obviously would have been probably a prototype before the production of, of, um, of the dinosaur. So yeah, all that's in there, nothing too special. Uh, what's this? We've got this little note. Oh yeah, the band. Belly band, which yeah, which is a common problem. So this is a really good condition um, Kentrosaurus that I've got. Both of them. I did acquire them many years ago when they were more affordable and more easier to find. So yeah, awesome Dino Rider. Quite, quite armored. I'm sure it would have been 
um, a very important asset in the rule on army against the Dino Riders. I'm sure Croc would have been someone that you wouldn't want to mess with, especially with the with the six lasers and that that towel club. He would have been yeah a force to reckon with. So anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this review and. See you later.